Okay, so that behind me is Kawaru Bridge. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, and that is one of the famous AJ Hackett bungees here in Queenstown. 43 meter drop down into the water below. Don't fancy it, but why am I here? Basically, this is one of the good freedom camping spots that you can get, one of the last couple that you can get while you're here in Queenstown. So let's go and check it out and see what you've got. Okay, so this is it. Pretty much nothing. It's a car park. <laughs> Um, but it is a car park within 20 minutes of central Queenstown, within easy access, 40 minute drive of Coronet Peak and the Remarkables, and it is free to stay here. There is no facilities, there is no toilets, there is no showers, but you can park up your van for the night and you are good to go. Super important on this trip. This is not the nicest car park or the nicest campsite that I've stayed in. It is close to a road, but this is the one that I've used the most, especially around Queenstown. Why have they stopped it? I don't know. I made another video on it asking the question, why have they stopped freedom camping in and around Queenstown? All I know they have, and this is my recommended spot for you guys if you are looking for a campsite in the Queenstown area. It's close to everything, it's quiet enough after night, but what do you need to know? To stay here, you can arrive after 6 p.m., but you have to be gone before 8.30 in the morning. So it's pretty much a turn up, pitch up, eat your dinner, chill out, get some sleep, and then get on the road in the morning. But a really nice spot for if you're in Queenstown. So just check it out. I'll try and put some sort of link to uh, CamperMate, the app which will help you find it down below. But this is the Kauru Bridge uh, Freedom Camp in Queenstown. Make sure you check it out.